At the Battle of Tours, Frankish leader Charles Martel defeated a large army of Arab invaders, halting the Muslim advance into Western Europe and ultimately saving Christianity. I'm Josh. And I'm Dave of Nerd and Dragon. And in this episode of our Battles That Changed the World series, we take a look at the Battle of Tours. The Battle of Tours took place in October 732, between the Franks and the Muslim army known as the Saracens. Islam was formed in 622 and the Middle East, which became united under it, began to conquer distant lands. By 720, the Muslims conquered Spain and sought to expand into the European continent, venturing into Aquitaine as far north as Burgundy. In 725, the Saracen governor of Spain, Ambessa, led his army over the Pyrenees into modern-day France and took on the fortified town of Carcassonne. Despite the battle going well, Ambessa received a fatal wound and the Saracens retired to the town of Narbonne before retreating back to Spain. In 732, the Muslims once again invaded under the command of Abdul Rahman al Ghafiqi Abd al Rahman. The Saracens laid siege to Bordeaux but soon got word of great treasures to be had in the Basilica of St. Martin in Tours. So al Rahman marched his men with the intent to plunder and pillage Tours. Up to this point, the Saracens' attacks had not worried or bothered King Charles of the Carolingian Empire, whose land bordered Aquitaine and included much of modern day northern France, Belgium, Netherlands. Luxembourg, Switzerland and parts of Germany. However, Tours was located within the empire and Charles marched his forces to meet the Muslims. In the ensuing battle, the Saracens were routed by the Frankish army and the army of Aquitaine, led by Odo the Great, who attacked the Saracens from behind. Abd al-Rahman was killed in action, as were around half of his 20 to 25,000 strong army, and the Muslims retreated south over the Pyrenees and would never march further north again. Had the Franks lost the Battle of Tours, it is believed that Christianity would have been conquered by Islam. Had Charles fallen in battle, there would have been no Charlemagne, no Papal States and no Holy Roman Empire. The victory gained at Tours was decisive and the torrent of Arab conquest was rolled back. Europe and Christianity were saved. Josh here. We hope you enjoyed this video and are enjoying our series. Liking and subscribing helps us out a ton. Thank you all for watching.